This is Talk of Asian Marketing with a special emphasis on localized Chinese consumer behavior. We got offered for free. That's right. Really nice guy. I'm gonna try that. Mm. Now that's a pretty good donut, actually. This one has the cheese on it. It tastes real good, you know. Well, it's really nice, really good. And that's that's the beauty of it. You really get these little tiny stalls. People really doing yeah. something special. And here we have something special. Some kind of squid. Sungi mm. sao. The squid fried up in these little things. It's kind of made into a little mash kind of thing, a little sort of soup, they pour it on, they cook it, and they turn it over and it's all nice crisp little balls, and it's kind of a little bit crispy on the outside, nice and soft on the inside. Then I thought, what they put on the outside, it looks like shavings, I think it's fried onion, but... Yeah, and then it sure. kind of, they fry it up to make it a little bit crispy, right? Yeah, exactly. Give a shot, Anthony, of the, of the holders they're putting them in, and they really get this kind of theme, you see? So you get these holders and they give you the theme and it fits in with the whole surface scape. And that's really interesting. So you, not only do you have a night market, but then each stand has a kind of unique flavor. And then they're also even in the packaging, you know. And you really don't see that much in China. You haven't reached that level of specialization, have you? No, no not like this. And you can see it's like there's a crowd sort of gathering around. Yeah, people yeah, yeah. come in and just like us now, people walk along, get a snack. By the time you walk the length of this place, you don't need to eat anymore, basically. Yeah, there's lots of food. Night markets are really all about food. And I really just think it's great. You know, you really have seen this develop in the last five to ten years where even your small stands have their own service scape. It is very localized and it's kind of very friendly. It's fast, it's convenient. Everyone just comes in, they know the price, it's straight, straight in, give the money and you're gone. Right. Anthony, swing around, get the crowd. It's packed. It's really packed. Uh, yeah. talking about the packaging. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, we were just talking about the package. Yeah. My mouth is watering, you know. <laughs> right here in the middle of it. Yeah, it's the thick of the night market and uh, and uh, overflowing around us. Know, it's just a little bustling in here. We had that real nice snack part. This store here, I think, is really interesting. We've just looked at. We rent the boxes. Um, Everything that's possible in a capitalistic sense. It's just wide open here. It, it just happens. I mean, people have got this idea: sell second-hand products in all boxes. You rent them out. They come come by. You've got this guy behind us. What's this guy selling? This is very common in even in the night market. We get people out here holding up signs to get your attention to go into another store. Sometimes they'll move around, sometimes they'll be standing there, sometimes they'll be waving flags. There's a lot of excitement. But I think the thing that we shouldn't mistake here is it's, it's kind of soft sell, isn't it? Because we're not getting people coming out, really pulling you in, or like often people sort of really feel an aggressive heart. It's very soft sell, and they might come out and promote a menu to you. But if you move on, you know, there's no big deal. It's kind of... You can go in, you can grab you can go through the merchandise, you can touch it, you can feel it. Yeah, sure. Even though we have these loudspeakers, it's not about pushing you to buy. It's about that zonal feeling, yeah, no. pushing that sound, <laughs> that excitement, making it loud, making it really exciting. Energy, isn't it? Yeah. Energy, all about energy. And like you said, you can go test it out, you can try it, nobody pushes it on you. That's it, yeah. Very yeah. friendly. Very like friendly, saw, very you know, relaxed. Our donuts, they wanted to give it to us for free. That's it. That's and it. They're so, so happy and literally. A lot of it as well is about telling you about the product, getting the information out. So you get these sort of flyers. I got one in my hand here for this store we were just looking at. Flyers, name cards, things telling you about it. What, what it's all about. And then the store holder often comes and really tells you about a new product, why it's special. They give you the little details and then if you're interested, you buy, if not, you move on. It's all very quick and transactional a lot of the time here. So, so I think that wraps it up for our visit to Yi Song Jay. That's great. New Year's coming. Happy New Year's. Great to you too as well. I think it's been a great year. So looking forward Steven. to more of it. Stephen, Stephen, get in Stephen in here to say goodbye and Happy New Year.
Steven, 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 we've lost it. Come on, come on over here. It's, it's easy to get separated. It's easy to get lost. It's easy to get lost. We're going to wrap it up here. This is our New Year's special. And so we say, Ikong Jay, this has been really exciting. Happy New Year to you. Yeah, Happy New Year. Okay. Yeah, happy New Year. Okay, then, wrap it up. Thanks. Thank you.